Hello everyone. Welcome to Marketing Automation with Avino. I hope all of you are healthy and doing great today. Uh, today we are going to talk about smart campaigns in market. We will we'll talk about what is a smart campaign, type of smart campaigns which are triggered and, and batch campaign. What's the difference in between triggered and batch campaign? How to create both in market on? So uh, we'll start with the what is smart campaign. Smart campaigns are most like a powerful tool in marketer. You can have triggered them on the basis of lead action or you can schedule them on the basis of field value, previously taken actions, etc. and, and perform fun further actions in flow section. Huh. And, and like as everyone says, marketer is extremely flexible anything you can think of you can run this is a true statement but it was made possible by smart campaigns so now comes the type of uh, smart campaigns there are two types of smart campaign we have in marketo one is the triggered one and second one is the patch campaign so we'll start with the triggered campaign uh, triggered campaigns, uh, as per the name suggests, it is an action or event-based campaign. Uh, triggered campaign affect one person at a at a time based on a triggered event. An example of a uh, triggered event would be clicking a link in an email or fill out form on your website or etc. Uh, now we talk about the batch campaign. A uh, batch campaign launches at a specific time and affect a specific set of people all at once example would be for a uh, batch campaign can be like uh, you want to target the leads uh, who are all from uh, california or any any specific country or usa and you want to send them one email yeah so now uh, we'll we'll see how to create a uh, smart campaigns in marketo uh, let's go to the uh, our market so I have created one uh, test program so we'll create a smart campaign just right click on your uh, program and go to new local asset and you'll have this option smart campaign and create just key the name of your smart campaign so we are testing something like a test campaign Okay, so so uh, when, while you are creating a smart campaign, you'll have like three to four tabs. Like as well, first is smart list. So in a smart list, you need to define uh, your target audience, or you want to add some actions on behalf of which you 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 want other other actions performed. So in a smart list, you'll define your target audience. In flow section, you'll define what the action you want on the basis of the target audience. And schedule tab, yeah, you can schedule your uh, campaign according to requirement. So, so how you'll get to know this smart campaign is triggered campaign or a batch campaign? So, as you can see at right side, we have two types of filters. One is the triggered one, and second is the normal filter. So uh, we'll start with the triggered one. Let's suppose uh, we we like rag and Rover fills out a form. So it is a uh, like a live action. Uh, as soon as someone fills out a form, we want them to receive a auto responded email or or registration confirmation email. So this is going to be a triggered campaign. So we have like you can see these filters are orange color so it's a it's a triggered campaign let's give a condition like if anyone filling out any form available in our market or in flow what action you want let's suppose we want to send them email or drag and drop email and just select the email if you have created any or you i don't know i'm selecting a random email you can whatever you have created you can give an email here and then you move to schedule there and in schedule tab you'll see uh, the smart list mode is the trigger this is a triggered campaign and here you can uh, define the uh, uh, 
qualification uh, criteria for this particular uh, smart campaign you want them to run every time you means like uh, so people let's suppose if a person have registered twice for your form and you what you want you want to send them email at once only or every time or you can define the days as well this is something you can define here and after that you have option to activate your smart campaign means it is a triggered campaign now let's suppose we remove this uh filter now we'll add like uh what i want like in past 30 days how many whoever have filled out form like dot form any form so whoever have filled out any form in last 30 days i want to send them this particular email so you can see the color is green it means it is going to be a batch campaign and now if you move to schedule tab you can see that mode is the batch and we don't have, have option now to activate it the option which we have is to run once so you want to run right now but it will take 15 minutes if you run as run now or you can schedule it according to requirement so in triggered campaign we do not have the scheduling option because it is going to be a action based campaign now okay if let's suppose if we have two types of uh, triggered filter let's suppose fill out form and click link in email select any email any form so so here uh, th these so because a lead cannot perform two actions at the same time right they cannot fill out form and as well as clicks link in email so triggered campaigns triggered filters always work in any condition means or condition you can you will not have the advanced filter for the your triggered filters and yeah that's all feel free to provide your uh, feedback or if i miss anything have a good day